it's been a hot minute. And when I say a hot minute, I mean red hot minute. <laughs> so let's cool that down and usher in the new year with some ice cream taste testing. Our favorite thing to do. Let's go. I'm Ascalon, Mrs. Ascalon. We're Team Rixie. It's been a while, but we are back. Another taste test video involving ice cream. And one of our favorite brands, Van Leeuwen, which is, as you will recall, the delicious French ice cream that has, you know, more eggs in it. So that's why they call it French ice cream. But it's delicious. They have a bunch of new flavors that we're going to tackle. <laughs> so we have, what, 10? 10. <laughs> that we're going to taste test in this video. So we're back with a bang. 2023, starting the year off right with some ice cream. Starting the year off with a stomach ache at the end of this video, probably. <laughs> I hope it helps my toothache, though. I got a toothache here that's kind of hurting a little bit. I put some put some ore gel on it, though. That helped a lot. So I think I'll be okay. And this ice cream should help. So what flavor are we starting with? I thought we were starting with champagne. Yes, because it's New Year's. All right, <laughs> so here it is. Van Leeuwen Champagne Ice Cream. There you go. Let's see what the description is. Just champagne ice cream. <laughs> Here's what it looks like. As champagne should look, it is pretty whitish yellow, sort of. It's, yeah. Does it smell like champagne? <laughs> uh, you got a big global. Yum. All right, here, here we, we go. go. First one. It's very okay. It's faint. Mm -hmm. It's not like super strong. That's but what I was about to say. Honestly, you wouldn't want it like super strong, right? Like, yeah. Mm. You taste a hint of champagne in there. Mm. Kind of odd, and I like. It. I'm not a huge fan of champagne, but you know, champagne flavored ice cream. Yeah, that's kind of mm. interesting. Okay, that's good. All right, I like it. The next one we are going to try. You want to introduce it? And this is the one I'm most excited about. This one? Yeah. I don't know how to say this, so I don't know why she well, had let me, me introduce it. it. <laughs> okay. It is a Mexican hot chocolate ice cream, and okay. they have paired with a Tapatio hot sauce. So I think this is a hot, uh, like a sort of hot cocoa infused with the actual hot sauce. And I think there's some cinnamon oh, in wow. it. Oh, wow. Yeah. So it's got a little double kick to it, maybe. This says, um, Nothing makes us happier than this Mexican hot chocolate ice cream. Chocolate ice cream with marshmallows and fudge swirls. But this isn't the hot chocolate you grew up with. This is way cooler. And by cooler, we mean hotter. Because we added <laughs> Tapatio hot sauce. Now it's a fiesta. So, my students, they love like, you know, sweet Mexican candy oh, and putting like some sort of pepper or something mm -hmm. on it. I'm just, I'm not a fan of that. I so I'm, I'm wondering if this ice cream or is going to taste kind of like that. they sprinkle it on that. their fruit. Yeah. Yeah, it's good stuff. All right, here we go. All right, new spoon. All right, she's really excited about this one, so she can go first. <laughs> oh, give me, I have to have a marshmallow in there. Oh. Well, I don't know if I'm going to get a marshmallow. Because marshmallows are hot chocolate. All right. Plus, I'm out. Big on chocolate ice cream. Anyway, so. Mmm. I like that. It mm. just tastes mostly chocolate. You don't taste the hot sauce? Mm-mm. I do. I mean, there's a little something there. A little heat. No, it's not. It's not if, strong. If you're worried about being spicy, it's really not Yeah, spicy. no, it's not spicy there's at all. There's a little hint of red pepper. Yeah. Mm. Uh, it's It's back there. I can kind of mm. get a, a hint of it, but not that's strong. Good. So it's good. The chocolate is very chocolatey. Yeah, that's not bad for chocolate ice cream. Like I said, I'm not a huge not fan of chocolate bad. ice cream, chocolate but actually, I actually like that. No, vanilla's the best. Mm, chocolate's the best. Vanilla. Chocolate. The next one we have is also seasonal. It is sweet potato marshmallow casserole. You know, like the kind you grandma. Interesting. <laughs> okay, so here's your your pre. And of course, I love Van Loon's packaging. I just think it's They're the very colorful. Thing. Yeah. Bright They're colors. They're adorable. And here's what this one looks like. Go ahead and grab my Yo, spoon. looks like sweet taters. <laughs> Let's have some. I'm a little nervous about this one as well. No. 
that's what I was about to say. Save me, save oh, me okay. a marshmallow. I'll you that one. <laughs> I didn't get one in the chocolate. Oh yeah. gosh, that was a big, big grubble. Wow. That is <laughs> that's good. Really good. That's really good. <laughs> it tastes like super good. It does. But but like not the consistency. Mm. 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 So it's it's ice cream, but it does taste like sweet potato. That one is much sweeter than the other two we just tried. Mm. I don't like it's that huge chunk of marshmallow sweet. though. Oh, I do. Oh, yep. I kind of ate it mostly by itself, not with the ice cream. So that was weird. <laughs> well, that's not how you supposed to do. Well, yeah, I, I didn't mean <laughs> that's to. good. I like that one. Yeah, don't eat the marshmallow mm. chunk by itself. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> All right, next one we're going to try. Caramel sticky. Bits. It sounds really good. See, this one sounds boring to me, but what? That's okay. it's okay. It's okay. What boring? You can agree to disagree. It's caramel, sticky bun. I mean, I feel like it's gonna be really good. What if it has sticky uh, bun one, pieces in it? Oh, I didn't even hold it up for the people. <laughs> See, that's that how much I, I just wasn't interested. I guess there you go. Caramel. <laughs> Ready sticky to bun. try it again. Like okay. <laughs> uh, and, uh, this one says. Anything good? Um, no. Sticky bunness. <laughs> I guess it's self-explanatory. Yeah. Alright. There's a chunk in there. What is that chunk? Ooh, there's it's a little salty. That's good. Mm-hmm. Mm. Cinnamon mum pieces. Okay. I was wondering if it had the and sticky bun pieces in it. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, yeah. Mm. I like it. Mm. That chunk surprised me, though. I wasn't expecting mm. it. Oh, mm. okay. I, I just got a chunk. Yeah. I, like I didn't the, realize it was in there ahead of time. I like the chunks. I do. Mm. I would and like there's more. a little saltiness in there. I would like more chunks. <laughs> chunky, chunky, chunky. Yeah, she loves chunky ice cream. You know that by now. Chunk. If you've seen any of our previous taste test videos, <laughs> most of All them right. involve ice cream. Then we have... To round out our first five... Peppermint patty ice cream. <laughs> so I'm assuming it's going to taste like, like a York like, patty yeah. with yeah. ice cream, like I that. guess. wonder if there's which, chunks of which, that in there. I'm predicting a mint chocolate chip flavor, but maybe it'll yeah. be a little different. I don't know. Okay. I, mean, I like York patties. It is patties not okay, green. So. It is white. Oh, wow. I didn't expect that. Green? I thought yeah. it was going to be green. Yeah. They okay. just made it green for the packaging. <laughs> well, the green in mint, pep mint chocolate chip is usually artificial. Ooh, the swirls in there. Some chocolate swirls. Wait for Mrs. Asclon to get oh, her gosh. scoop before I, I dive into mine. totally just almost had an accident. Mm. Yeah. Wow, that is strong. Peppermint ice cream and chocolate chips and swirls of fudge. Yeah, strong peppermint mm, flavor. I like it. Mm. Peppermint flavors. Do you a little not like, overpowering to me. Do you not like mint chocolate chip? I mean, uh, yeah, that's chocolate not... chip. <laughs> that's not an ice cream flavor that I just gravitate towards, but... I've always liked it, but... I like um, York peppermint patties. So I, I mean, I like those it. okay. But yeah, that was very mm -hmm. strong. I don't know about that one. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I like could it. eat more of it, but... It's not one that I'm just like... want to keep going back for mm -hmm. more and more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know if mm -hmm. Mrs. Saskalon can say the same thing. That's good. <laughs> All right, first five are done. I feel like I'm playing a golf game, like the front five, the front nine, you know, is done. Now we're on the back five. <laughs> so let's get into these last five flavors. So what's number six? Number six is red velvet. Yum, yum. My family members love red velvet cake. I'm so, not a huge fan of it, but. You know, red velvet is chocolate. Chocolate, So yes. I wonder if, let's see. Um, you can eat this on the couch, you can eat this as you crouch, you can eat this while you carry a pouch. That doesn't tell Dr. me anything Seuss. about flavor. <laughs> Had bars like Dr. Seuss. You can eat this red, this ice cream anywhere because it has red cream cheese ice cream and brownies. Oh, okay, because okay. usually red velvet cake has cream cheese frosting, frosting right? Frosting, yeah. Okay. Oof. Look at that pretty. Yeah, that's very really red. Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. It looks like cherry almost. All right, I'm ready. Are you ready? Dive in. Y'all. I mean, I'm semi-ready, y'all, though. Mmm. 
can't go wrong with Red Velvet. Well, you can't go wrong with Van Leeuwen's ice cream, though. Oh, right. Good. So good. That is interesting. Kind of weird. I like it, but it's not my favorite. I got hit with a lot of cream cheese flavoring. Cream cheese. You know what it reminds me of? What? It reminds me, just a skosh, of the macaroni and cheese ice cream. <laughs> what? It's kind of salty like that and cheesy. Oh, okay. You don't think so? <laughs> no, but that's fine to each their it's own. It's <laughs> not as gross as the macaroni and cheese, but there's a little... There's a little, like, salty umami something in there. Ooh, umami. I learned what that word meant the other day on Food right. Network. <laughs> All right. The next one we have is a hazelnut fudge cookie. It sounds like a Girl Scout cookie. <laughs> yeah, but, I don't know. <laughs> but that's not... You know, like, sometimes they're like, oh, chocolate sandwich cookie. I know it's an Oreo, dude. Like, I get it. But I don't know, or what the peppermint patty, you know, that's York. Yeah. But what's this? Hazelnut fudge cookie. Chocolate hazelnut. Um, Italian hazelnuts, crumbles of spice, speculose cookies. What's a speculose cookie? Those, um, Biscoff. Oh. Those, oh. She likes those. My gosh, the stuff you make cookie butter out of. Keep <sighs> Swirls of rich dark chocolate. Yum. I love speculos. Okay. <laughs> Get my Yum. Spoon give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Ooh, nice little swirl. Did you show it to the peeps? Oh, did I? I don't know. I can't remember. I thought I did, but it's okay. <laughs> it's a broken swirl now. <laughs> oh, yum. I want some speculos in there. <laughs> speculos. That's a weird word. That sounds like a glucose family member. Got your fructose, your Ooh. glucose, your speculose. Mm-hmm. It's not speculose. Speculose? Look. Oh. <laughs> My bad. Mm. That was not bad. Mm-hmm. I didn't really know what I was going to expect okay. with that one, but. Okay, so this is called hazelnut fudge cookie. I taste more like cinnamon than hazelnut mm-hmm. from the speculos. So I don't know. It said it had Italian hazelnuts in there, but I don't taste any nuts. Do you? No. Hmm. It tastes good. Hmm. I, yeah, I get But it's, if you like hazelnut, like Nutella, it's not, it doesn't taste like that. No, no, no. It at tastes all. more like a Biscoff cookie with some chocolate. All right. Three more. Next one is. This is kind of weird. Nah. <laughs> but it might be good. Pumpkin cinnamon roll. I didn't want to eat this right next to uh, caramel sticky yeah. bun because I <laughs> thought it was kind of similar. But okay, let's see. Ooh. Ooh. Orangey interior. Orange. Orangey glad it's. Van <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Let's see. Pureed pumpkin, cinnamon rolls, a little nutmeg, swirls of cinnamon caramel. Maybe that autumn chill is the air. Uh, Sorry. (laughs) Read your words. (laughs) Maybe that autumn chill in the air is coming from the freezer. So pumpkin part is throwing me off. This is one of their fall. By the way, all these flavors were like from like different releases that they had through like fall and the holidays and stuff. So I just got as many as I could. Like we didn't try, we haven't tried that one yet. We haven't tried that one yet. We haven't tried that one yet. And y'all, these are not cheap. I'll just say it right now, but <laughs> I don't care. We do it for y'all. I, look, I used my Christmas money to get me those. So. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Tastes a lot of pumpkin. That reminds me of the, um, the little Debbie pumpkin pie delight. Mm-hmm, a little bit. Mm-hmm. A little better. <laughs> Sorry, little Debbie. Little Debbie, she really. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm-hmm. I have lots of chunks in that. Mm-hmm. Not bad. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That'll remind me a little bit of that sweet potato one we had earlier, too, a little bit. Yeah, but it's definitely more pumpkin pie-ish. Yeah. The sweet potato one was a little sweeter. Mm-hmm. Two to go. You ready? 
I was born this ready. This one, I love the packaging. It is this bright, hot pink. Let me, let me, <laughs> let me get it ready it's for like you. It's like fuchsia almost. It's beautiful. Woo! It is chocolate covered strawberry. Mm. Mm. <laughs> These last five, I've been kind of. Okay. Um, chocolate ice cream with strawberry pieces throughout. That's it. <laughs> That's it. All right. I was expecting more. <laughs> <laughs> the spoons took a tumbly. More chocolate ice cream. I like chocolate. You need some. Where are the strawberries? I didn't see any in my chunk. Okay, there's there's some in there. Yeah, go digging for them. So that's not a good sign. Well, it's sometimes not a lot of the chunks kind of settle at the bottom because they're heavier than when you, you know, if it melts a little. And that's like dark chocolate. Mm mm. Mm. I like it. Mm. But I like dark chocolate. I didn't have any chocolate. It's, it's not super sweet. So all I got was dark chocolate, dark mm. chocolate, dark chocolate. You didn't get any? Just smacking See, me in the I face. See, I got a big old chunk of strawberry. It was good, too. Mm. Eh, I don't want to taste that again. I like dark chocolate. <laughs> That's good. It's not... The reason I like dark chocolate better than milk chocolate or white chocolate is not as sweet. And it's more cocoa-y. And that's what I like. It's got that weird aftertaste to me. Like, mm. last one. And last we say this one. one for last on purpose. Okay. Because this holiday is forthcoming. Upcoming. Whatever you want to say. <laughs> also, we have done another taste test for this particular flavor. But a different brand. Yeah. So, anybody remember the Bluebell King Cake ice cream video that we had? So, here is what this ice cream is made of. Cinnamon cake flavored ice cream with pastry pieces. A cream cheese swirl and candy sprinkles. That Yum. sounds pretty good. All right. We have our little ice cream. See how they're... Green and gold and purple swirly. Yeah, there's like little purple specks in there. Very Mardi Gras. Here we go. So I guess we're going to go at the same time? Yep, let's do All it. All right, let's do this. I'm trying to get me a good chunk. That's pretty good. You said this is cinnamon ice cream? Oh, and cinnamon ice cream is like one of my faves. Well, Van Leeuwen has their own version of a king cake ice cream. So this one says, um, there are no plastic babies to be found, thank you, in this pint. <laughs> oh, baby, flavor babies. <laughs> Sorry. Because each colorful scoop crowns the eater king. What? What? <laughs> so don your mask for this treat of sweet cream ice cream with yellow, green, and purple swirls and cinnamon blondie cake pieces. If it doesn't have... The little sugar sprinkles in it. I'm not going to like it as well as Blue Bell. <laughs> oh, but I think it does. <gasps> oh, y'all look. Oh, that's beautiful. You can't see it too well on the camera, but there's like these little sparkly pieces in that. Look. You yeah, see I see it? it. Oh, my goodness. Please. Oh, my gosh. I'm taking a big old bite. Got chunks in it. Oh, look at all that. Mmm. All right. Whatever that chunk is I had was pretty good. That was the first thing I tasted. Got some like candy pieces in there, so. Mmm. That is. That's probably my favorite one. Y'all. That was good. Y'all. I'm trying to take a little bit. We haven't double did. Oh, we haven't double no. did the whole time. Nobody can have this if you come over. Sorry. <laughs> well, now I get some more. <laughs> We're out of spoon, so. Mmm. <laughs> That's delicious. That's good. I like that mm. chunk. What is that chunk that's in there? Mm -hmm. I didn't really say in the description, right? That was good. Cinnamon blondie cake. Yeah, that's, cinnamon blondie. That's good. That's cinnamon mm. blondie. 
That's real good. That's it. And the crunchy, the crunchy sugar crystals. I think we I definitely say the best for last because oh that goodness. was really good. Very good. Mm. I don't really care to rank these because they're all wildly different. Yeah. I will say my favorites were. I like the king. I cake. liked them all. First of all, like them all. I like the king cake. I like the sweet potato casserole. And I really like the chocolate covered strawberry, but the other two were better. But they're all good. Yeah. Van Leeuwen makes some good ice cream. The chocolate ones for me were kind of... Mm -hmm. Now, <laughs> these were all about five bucks a pint. Like I said, I used my Christmas money for the video. So, <laughs> um, there were a couple that were on sale, but I didn't know until I did the self-checkout at Walmart. And, of course, yes, I got, I got these at Walmart. That's what you find. Sorry. A couple of them rang up at like three seventy five, so I guess maybe they were some of the like the older fall, ones, like the yeah, fall flavors. They weren't labeled as such. I just knew it when I checked out. So, but um, these are good. Hi, I come. So your Walmart may still carry some of the even the fall ones. So you gotta hurry and go take a look, and if you want to try any of those, they're all delicious. But what do you think was the weakest link? I know what I think. The weakest one? Yeah. I didn't like the chocolate covered strawberry. See, I think the champagne was the weakest link because I thought that was flavor kind of was a little weak. Yeah, but it and was, it was kind of boring. It was still good though. So yeah. Yeah, the champagne didn't have any chunks, but that would be weird if you had chunky champagne. <laughs> like, what would you put chunks in there? Here's yeah. chunks of alcohol for you. <laughs> champagne shots. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Another taste test video for you for the new year. Happy New Year 2023. Hit that like button if you like this video. More taste test videos coming from us in the future. We're going to be recording some other videos. We went on a trip recently right before Christmas. And so we got some more restaurant reviews that are coming your way. Like it's been a while mm. for those. And so we'll get back to talking about I Disney like World him. and stuff like that. Um, it's been a while since we talked about any vacation places. So those are coming soon. So look out for those. Drop us a comment below. If you tried any of these ice cream? I have, the, you, <laughs> I have the hiccups because I ate all that ice cream so fast. But yeah, if you tried any of these flavors, let us know which one's your favorite and you know what you think about them. Are you going to go run to your local Walmart and go try them? Let us know if you do. We'd love to hear from you. Subscribe to our channel. That would be awesome <laughs> to start the new year. We're opening the new year with, I think, 334 subscribers as of the making of this video. And so if you like the content, check out our other stuff, our other taste test videos, vacation videos. If you like it, definitely hit that subscribe button. We have an Instagram page for our channel called Team underscore Rixie where we post vacation pictures. Anything else you want to add? Hey, go to his, his uh, channel, Ascalon. <laughs> oh, yeah, I have a gaming channel, he, He's Ascalon. getting close to 1,000 subscribers, so he'd love to see you bump that number up. Yeah, I have 870 as of the filming of this video, so... 130 out, like I'm getting close <laughs> with that channel to a thousand, so hoping to get there soon. But anyways, we gotta go eat some dinner. I'm not hungry. <laughs> I am. I just had ten bites. <laughs> Eleven, because I had two of the king cake. Oh yeah. Eleven bites of ice cream. I'm not hungry at all. <laughs> but anyways, y'all take care. We hope you have a blessed and wonderful year. See you in another video. Peace.